welcome to my channel. I'm Crafty Lady Edda. Uh, today we're going to be doing a very different kind of a project. So if you like what I do, please subscribe, tap that notification bell, and YouTube will notify you of any and all upcoming videos. Okay? And like and share. Okay, let's get started. Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. I'm Crafty Lady Edda. Uh, today we're going to make some 4th of July tin can posies. Okay, so you're gonna need two different kinds of tin cans. I have happened to have a big one in the, in a medium sized one. And you're gonna need some wire, have red wire. You're gonna need maybe just one. I don't know if I'm gonna use this yet. It's a cork. You're gonna need some white Waverly paint. You're gonna need some mud podge. You're gonna need different kinds of ribbon. I have these ones left over from my last project, uh, the Star Spangles and this one. And I also have this, just in case I'm not going to use it. I also have a piece of blue ribbon. I might want to use it as a trim at the bottom. I have letters. I might want to use letters, like the word bless, but I'm not sure yet. I have one thing of napkins. I bought this at the Dollar Tree, it's a flag. And I have these. I'm gonna incorporate one of these in one of my in one of my tin can projects. Okay, it's the one I did last time. And I'll put in the description box below where I got these. Okay. And you're also going to need some flowers, red, white, and blue. YouTube loves you. <laughs> It rhymes, huh? <laughs> I got these at the Dollar Tree, all of them. Okay. Um, I also got these to use as, you know, another part of the embellishment. Okay. Well, with all this being said, let's get started. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and, and do this tin can here. What I'm going to do, I'm going to have to paint these white um, for the reason that when you mud parts something, it's going to it's going to get through to the can, and I don't want it showing. So I'm going to go ahead and start painting. Okay, I'm Okay, so I went ahead and mud podge this on here. You're going to do the one ply. And you're just going to do the one layer. See, look. It has two plies. This one and a white one and this other one. See? I only cut one. And then I just mud podged it on here. I put a little bit of mud podge first and then I put it on and I mud podged it down. Okay? Now we're going to just go ahead and let it dry. Okay guys, now while this one's, that one's drying, I'm going to go ahead and put ribbon on this one. I'm only going to do the front. So with this, I'm going to hot glue this one down.
guys, I'm gonna go ahead and put some blue ribbon here. Or should I do red? No, I think blue would be good. I'm just gonna put some blue ribbon across here. Guys, I went ahead and stuck, poke a hole through here, and I stuck the wire to this. I'm gonna put some beads, red, white, and blue on each side. Guys, I know I didn't tell you to buy to get this, but I already have it, so I'm going to use this to stick inside to kind of fill in the inside so the flowers won't be flying around. And, okay, now I'm going to get one of these blocks. First of all, let me see if it's going to fit in here. No, I don't need to have it. I'll just stick it in. There you go. Even better. Just gonna have to put a little bit more grass up here. This is reindeer moss. This is moss that I've had left over. So, yeah. I just 
decided to use these flowers for this. So I'm going to stick them in here. <laughs> Stick some of these in there. Guys, I'm going to use the word bless and I'm going to put on this other can. So I'm going to paint the word bless. Guys, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the edge of this marker just to outline the edges a little bit. Give it kind of a little rustic look. Guys, now I'm going to hot glue this word bless down here at the bottom. I'm going to use these people here, these kids. Be right here.
guys, I'm making a little bowl out of this. So let's see how it comes out. The best, the best kind of a. Uh, Ribbons to work with is the one with wire in it. Okay, let me see. Okay, my cute. A little. So. I know it came out kind of weird, but I thought it came out kind of cute. And then just fluff it up. That's okay, because I want it to look a little rustic. See? I'm just going to hot glue it up here. It's okay if it looks tattered. I want it to look like this, tattered. Guys, I'm going to use these uh, these here, these flowers. I got these at the Dollar Tree, so I'm just going to stick them in here. And then I'll put a little bit of this in the front. came out super cute I love the way it came out so yeah these are some pocket posy for fourth of July okay well if you like what I do please subscribe tap that notification bell and YouTube will notify you of any and all upcoming videos and share okay until next time keep on crafting bye